Hi, uh, my name is Andrew Devaney, and um, the speech that I will be giving today is called Influential Moments in Life. Um, as I take a look at life in general, I find that relationships um, have the, seem to have the most impact on individuals, um, whether it's a relationship of a really strong bond or a relationship that has seemed to fail um, due to some sort of circumstance. Um, and in this speech, I will talk about three significant, significant occurrences in my life that, has, that have had a great impact on me today. I will discuss how these occurrences all came due to relationships, I believe. Um, I will first talk about my relationship with Jesus Christ, and second, I will talk about my family, and last of all, I will talk about... Um, a good friend um, and someone that is actually my boss. Um, his name is Josh DeWitt. So to start, um, I guess what first com comes to my mind when I talk about changing occurrences or a great relationship in my life, I would have to talk about my relationship with Christ. Um, I really do believe that Christ saved me. Um, and I do believe what the Bible has to tell us about who he is and about our own lives. Um, you know, I believe that we are sinners. And the consequences for sin is death um, and eternal death. And we, we as humans don't choose God. Um, I, I believe that God is very persistent towards us and... Um, if, if it really was up to us, we wouldn't choose God. It's God's love that draws us to Him. And I really do believe Christ saved me from my sin. Um, in a sense, I would say that He gave me new desires. I really do believe He did. Um, he fixed a lot of relationships in my life. He taught me what it means to be a Christian. Um, and I, I just, the, the verse out of John that says, We will know who Christians are, by how they love. Um, that, that really like was influential and just like had a huge impact on my life. Um, God sh has revealed to me through his word how to love people, what it means to love people. Um, and he's also given me a servant's heart. Um, what I would have to say about all that is I really am not where I should be. Um, I don't, I don't, I mess up all the time. I'm not anywhere near the ideal Christian, um, but I do believe that I'm a sinner saved by the grace of God. Um, second um, occurrence in my life would be my family. Um, to start, I'll just um, read this quote. It says, when you look at your life, the greatest happinesses are family happinesses. This is a quote by Joyce Brothers. Um, and this idea of family kind of got turned upside down for me around my junior year of high school. Um, my uh, parents got divorced. I'm not going to go into a great detail. I don't really enjoy talking about this topic too much. I don't find a need to tell a lot of people, but it has had a large significance in my life. And the fam my family's divorce didn't have a really emotional great emotional effect on me. It didn't change me for the worse. Um, it was hard, but I th I see the strength. I, I had so much strength, I think, from God from it. He gave me so much comfort and really allowed me to look past it um, and, and helped me. He really gave me a rock, a foundation, and it wasn't wavering. Um, I, I really felt as if I was standing on something solid, um, and I had a hope, and my family's divorce has taught me a lot. Um, it's taught me a lot about what it means to be a father, um, what it takes to be in a marriage. Um, not saying that I'm even close for <laughs> if, if I'm ready for that, but it, I mean, it really has, like, taught me a lot, um, and it's really easy to focus on the negative things that your parents did, but 
you see those things and you see what they didn't do and it I, I believe that if you focus on the good things on you focus on things that are good on what it takes to be a father or what it takes to be a mother what it takes to hold a marriage together instead of focusing on all the negatives you will become the positives that you focus on um, and I mean I guess that would be enough of that my last one would be uh, my friendship with Josh DeWitt um, Josh gave me this great opportunity to work for a company called Win Give um, Win Give is a company that is focused on giving um, I guess our kind of motto phrase is backpacks for backpacks um, pretty much what how it works is people like you um, would buy a backpack or merchandise off our website and that um, in fact would give a backpack with school supplies to a kid in need. Um, this next slide will kind of show you some pictures of what we've done and what we're going to do still. Um, Josh and one of his good friends Donnie who also is part of WinGive um, went on a trip to Guatemala and gave out over a hundred some backpacks and these are some awesome pictures of like how <laughs> much these kids enjoyed it um, and and we really believe in it is better to give than to receive um, you know and soon I'm gonna be going to Tanzania Africa and we've collected all this stuff um, for this trip that I can bring along, 50 some backpacks, um, soccer balls, jump ropes, frisbees, crayons, notebooks, pencils, pens, um, and, and our, our motto really is just giving and the only way that we can give is through support through people and the coolest part about you supporting is it benefits you too, you get this awesome clothing merchandise, you can get backpacks um, and it gives to kids in need. I mean I, I guess there's, I don't find a much greater joy than serving people um, you know and I guess as a little um, business uh, reference I'm just gonna tell you all to visit win give it's my little business pitch I guess was the word that I was looking for is to visit win givecom um, just to kinda like see how you can help I think it's an awesome opportunity for everyone um, in conclusion, all of these significant occurrences, all of these have been significant occurrences in my life, and I believe they are all due to relationships. My relationship with Christ changed my life. I believe um, my family had a great significance on who I am today. I mean, something like that doesn't just go over your head. It isn't something that you forget about. It it it's something that does change you and affect you um, and my relationship with Josh DeWitt he's my friend and he gave me this op awesome opportunity to, to be a part of this company that is looking to do a greater good in giving to people in need um, I guess I have just one last question before I go and that is to ask you guys are the most significant memories and moments in your life due to relationships um, I just want you all to think about that thank you